anybody else's hands, this is a microphone. In my hands, it's a pipe too much bomb. to be done on this pipe mic bomb. that I ain't doing ready. Pipe bomb. Pipe bomb. Pipe bomb. In anybody else's hands, this is a microphone. Alright, so I won the predetermined dice roll. I've had to speed this up because I really, I know you guys don't want to you know, 20 minute video anyway. I love Doom Traveler. I think I got a good opening hand. Rather happy with it. And he has no play first turn, but I have a serious feeling I'm walking headfirst into a mirror match. So, let's get out the Unruly Mob, which I actually like a lot more than other people. Then again, I like a lot of cards more than other people. Now, interesting. I can play a third turn Micaeus the Lunark, but I don't know what his second color is. If it's red or blue, I'm screwed. Okay, it's green, so I gotta worry about Prey Upon. So I wanna get my Micaeus out when I have the mana to kinda control what power level she is. Um... Also, I mean, just beating them down with creatures works also. So, <laughs> what's this? Uh, four mana, okay, Mausoleum Guard. Yum. Red Robin, yum. You know, there's no Red Robins in Brooklyn. None. Yeah, I should have uh, attacked with the Unruly Mob. I, I kind of knew his plan there. Okay, so I got Micaeus out. That's good. That, that worries me a little bit, but... I seriously doubt he can do anything, like, okay, I won the match. Um, I know what's, I know his deck, because his deck is my deck, so I feel pretty good about my deck, uh, you know, that Woodland Sleuth is still kind of angering me. Um, the Boneyard Worm might actually make sense here. Um... But, no. Not today. Uh, not a great opening hand, but I'll stick with it. I mean, all I really need is a forest, and I'm... Against his deck, I think I'm pretty much in good shape. Uh, I got my Mask of Everburger Burger Burger. I got my Super Creature, able to leap tall buildings in a single bound. Ugh. I hate that card. <laughs> that card has lost more games for me than any other card. I don't know why I put that out now, but I figure, why the hell not? Um, so, he now has a choice. And he's either going to... Hopefully, he doesn't have a play. Good. Okay, he pumped it. Alright. Alright. There's my forest, okay. You know, I'm really happy if a guy doesn't have a turn 3 play. I'll take the 4 damage instead of having to... Okay. Play my Ambush Viper. It's a Viper and it ambushes you. I think that's uh, that should be 2 abilities. And a Mausoleum Guard. Yum. Oh, yay. Um, I could really use some mana. Mana would be nice, but we all know how the shuffle works. It's quote unquote random. Man, I should have, I should have smelled something right there. Something right there did not look right. Now that play right there was amazing. I love that play. He used Make a Wish. Probably the best you can possibly use that card. Hell, they should name a foundation after Make-A-Wish, the way that he used that card so well. And now he has six mana. He could replay both cards and essentially get four 1-1 one -one flyers for, for nothing. I, really, I have to give him tons of credit for that. Now I have two choices. I'm going to choose to protect my villagers of 
Esmeralda and not play anything so I have a massive uh, creature on the board that there's nothing he could do about um, and he won't attack because he knows that attacking with his ground creatures is just gonna make my oh crap all right um, go for it connect four Attacking with his ground creatures, I'll just block with the Elder Cathar. And. Okay, so he's choosing to attack. Let me take out the muzzle. Oh! Oh! <laughs> that wasn't good. I chose not to block with the Elder. Let's keep it open just in case. Um, all right. Okay. Now that's that's nice. I like that. Um, put it out for one. That's that's a huge mistake. I know he has a prey upon. But hopefully he doesn't. Okay. It's not too bad. I'll go Hi. down to eight. Hi. Sure. And there's the prey pump. Well, oh. Oh, yeah. Lifelink, I don't think, works when it comes to. Um... Yeah, that playing Micaeus that early was not a smart move on my part, to be honest. Um, but now I have a very nasty creature that blocks all his fires, so. Um. Sure. Uh, I'm gonna start blocking his stuff. Uh. Uh-oh. Okay, pumping. Thank you. Um. Gonna make my creature larger. That's not good. I'll admit. Oh, Mr. Juggernaut. But I don't want to play you. I want to keep that rebuke open. I don't like Juggernauts. I actually have enough to block, use the moment of heroism. Or I could just put out my indestructible hexproof flyer. Either one works. Now I'm going to put out the Juggernaut, which makes this Fester Hide Boar useless. And I got a moment of heroism in hand. So the, the smart pr professional player would say, I now have the board stabilized, Captain. And I attack. He chooses not to block, so I'll gain some life. Got no issues there. And now I'm ahead. And barring a... Uh... Actually, there's nothing he could do. So he's got a 5-5, five, five, unless he can make... Unless he has a moment of heroism. Something like Bonds of Faith, that's not good. That's not good either. That's not good. Oh, well, all those things were just not good. Um, nothing I could do. Down to nine, but I still have a rebuke and a hope for... Actually, I can play my, uh... Oh! Uh, 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 uh. Now he has to block. So now he's essentially dead. And I get a slightly larger unruly mob. Uh, and my rebuke is going to take out his last flyer. So he's pretty much dead at this point. I don't know what's in his hand. Maybe it's like the last guy and he's got two. Uh, you're dead. Boom.
desperation play. Definite desperation play. Um, and that's game right there. Because I have the hexproof two three no uh three four I think yeah and he cannot kill it without a blasphemous act except yeah okay there it is. Yeah.